And the spooky festivities are taking place all across the Arklatex and across the country right now. And KSLA News 12's Tamer Knight is live from the citywide Shreveport Trunk or Treat at the Cargill Sports Complex. Now, Tamer, the event is well underway. I know that we've been checking in. Lots of great kiddos and costumes out there, and it looks like you're having a lot of fun, too. Missy, I heard that Halloween is your favorite holiday. We certainly wish that you could join us out here because as you can see, since we last chatted, hundreds of more people have showed up to the citywide Shreveport trunk or treat. And listen, it's a time. They have free nachos. You know I got me a plate. And then also there's lots of candy and drinks and snowballs and everything you can think of to have a very safe and fun Halloween for 2023. Now Armani is going to join me right now and I personally picked her because look at her costume. You have to admit this is really cute. She really did her thing with this one. Armani, tell me how you decided to come up with this costume for Halloween. I decided because it was like, I love Pennywise and I love the movie. So I just picked because I wanted to be scary for Halloween. And what's your favorite part about Halloween and what you've seen so far at the Trunk or Treat this year? My favorite part is about Halloween is the celebrating and people and candy. Candy, B2. Now, Armani is special because she was actually nominated for Student of the Year. How crazy is that? So, not only is she celebrating Halloween, but she's celebrating her big nomination. Now, you still have time to come out and join us. The event is going on at the Sports Car, Sports Guild Sports Complex until 7 p.m. But for right now in Shreveport, I'm Tamer Knight, KSLA News 12. Tamer, thanks. Have enough fun out there for the both of us because, like you said, Halloween is my favorite. So get out there, get us some candy, and enjoy the nachos as well.